Okay, um, I'm in your save, and, uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to check all the parking brakes. These brakes are both off. So I'm going to leave this in neutral. And, uh... <clears throat> I'm going to also check the, uh, the valves on each, uh, brake line. They yeah, are both open. Okay, that's released. I didn't want to do that, but okay, that's open. That's open. Come on. Connected. Okay. If the way I'm checking to see that they're actually released um, is when I hear that, you hear that clunk, that bang, that tells me that the brake is actually released. Hey, okay, that's con that's open, connected, open. Okay, that's open. Come on, my mouse is not acting uh, very kindly lately. Anyway, uh, moving along here, I had a brief interruption. Okay, open, connected. Come over here, that's open. Come on, there we go. There we go, there we go, okay. That one was completely closed. So that handbrake was not completely released. Okay. Let's check the back valve on a brake pipe. Okay, that's closed. Oh, too far. Do this this Okay, we'll do it that way. Okay. So we go to forward. Make sure the brakes are released. Okay, everything looks good. I'll go to outside camera F2. And forward and onward. And I'm pushing the uh, throttle pedal to the metal. Okay. Okay, hmm. coming up to the tunnel. Get back inside. And we're doing a little over 30. Mm. 
Okay, so we're losing speed here. I'm... Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Pushing a little too hard because of the gradient. Still moving. A bit slow, but moving. Moving at roughly 10 kilometers an hour. Or in American uh, terms, it's 10 miles per hour. It's starting, it's going to overheat. So I'm going to back off on the throttle and hit the brakes. Now, when I first got into the game, trying to understand everything, uh, this is all I had. And I went into free roam. Basically, uh, do whatever you want mode. And, uh, well, that's what I call it anyway. Um, and, uh, there was a couple of hills I couldn't, I had a hard time getting up. And this is the way I did it. I would get to the point where it's overheating. And it's about to pop the circuit breaker over here. So I just slam on both brakes. So the train wouldn't slide back downhill. And just wait for everything to cool off a little bit. Then what I would do is give it a little bit of throttle and release the brake. Come yeah, on. It's gonna pop. But if you get it, if you do get it moving with a fair amount of speed, it'll cool off. I know that's uh, quite a bit high on the temperature. But so far, I haven't popped any breakers. And I'm still moving. So. And I'm gaining a little bit of speed. Not a lot, but I'm gaining some speed. No blinky lights. Well, there is one because it's overheating. But if you notice, as I gain a little bit of speed, it's also cooling off. Ooh, 60? Really? I can do 60? Wow. <laughs> sure thing. Okay, this is not pedal to the metal, not full throttle. I just gave it another nacho. And if you notice, the temperature just bumped up, so I'm going to drop it down a nacho. I didn't even notice what the gradient is here. But anyway, we're st I'm still moving. Now I know that's not a good sign. The temperature is in the red, but still moving, haven't popped the circuit. 
actually uh, put the front lights on, which I forgot to do. No, no need to put real lights on because there's no lights on the back of the train. So I'm holding steady. I don't know what nacho uh, I'm at because there's no, um, yeah, there's no marking. So I don't know what it's at. I'm guessing three, nacho three. And I'm still gaining a little bit of speed and that little bit of speed is helping to cool off. My brakes are staying pretty steady. RPMs are 80. And my amps are actually pretty low, considering how hard this little thing is working. Now, if you notice, I'm almost at, I would guess is 15 uh, KMH. And the temperature dropped down into the yellow, which is better. But I'm still climbing. And uh, let's do two outside. Ooh, that's loud. Okay. That's with uh, four cars with containers on it. Okay. That's a lot. And for this little thing. Wow. Anyway. Here we go. Hey, okay, let's take a look and make sure there's no brakes turning high as a devil. So all the brakes are released. And no screechy screechy. Get back inside the cab. Okay, our temperature's gone up a little bit. And our amps are climbing now. And I haven't touched the throttle. But our speed is also going down. This is a major hill here. Wow. So if this thing continues to climb in temperature, Okay, drop the speed down, put the brakes on so we don't go down sliding the hill. Go down, yeah, that was, sure, I know what I'm talking about. So we don't go sliding backwards down the hill is what I meant to say. But anyway, um, I didn't notice any gradient markers. Let me... I don't even know what gradient this is, to be honest with you. And let me try three. Any gradient markers? No? Oh, I, I, I missed it. Oh, okay, this is a plus 2.2 upwards gradient okay that explains that i missed that one that's my mistake so everything's pretty much cooled off still in forward gear and 
and drop the brakes. Two, that's Nacho three. We're starting to slide down the hill. Come on. Nacho four. Come on. Just enough speed to keep it from popping the circuit. Okay, so... So far, so good. I haven't popped the circuit yet. Okay, so we got another... Okay, so our gradient is going to 0 0.3. If I'm reading that correctly. I am really surprised that this has not popped the circuit. I guess it's getting an... Oh, no. 1.5. Okay. Plus 1.5. So our gradient is slowly going downwards. Okay. Well, I should say decreasing. Our gradient is decreasing. And I'm not going to push the throttle any harder, but we're staying at 10 kmh. Brakes, uh, brake pipes and reservoir are holding steady. Well, our RPM, engine RPM is staying pretty steady at 80. We're pretty hot under the hood there, but uh, there must be enough air coming through to cool it to keep it from popping the circuit. And our amps have gone up into the yellow, which I'm surprised at, considering I am not pushing the throttle that hard. Okay, our gradient is uh, plus 1.6, if I read that right. Not sure which way I need to go, but... Here we go. We are now picking up some... Picking up some steam to 20. And... Our temperature is dropping like a rock. Okay. We drop the throttle down to Nacho one, I think. Two. Nacho zero. Okay. Nacho one. Two. Three. Okay, we'll leave it at Nacho two. Because we're still climbing. That was not a smart idea to lower the speed. But by m by just sheer luck, I haven't popped the circuit and I'm still climbing. That means there's just enough air getting underneath the hood to keep things from getting overheated and popping a circuit. 
So I don't know if this is the way this route uh, is supposed to go for this particular scenario. But uh, let's see, do three. Yeah, that leave me train behind. Okay, so we go back. Uh, okay, there's a split in the track and the road, so to speak. So I've made it up this far. Again, I don't know if that's the way you're supposed to go or not, but um, I'm doing it just to show how far I've gotten so far. I'm going to go back by the tunnel. And the starting point. Okay, so we hit back. I'm, I hit F1 to get back into the cab. And we're heading up to another tunnel. And our temperature has dropped down into the yellow. We're above 20 kmh, and our amps have dropped, and I haven't touched the throttle at all. So, it seems like that was your problem, um, and maybe this little tip on climbing a hill with one of these uh, DE2s might help you uh, further your career. I'll cut the video off at the end of the tunnel. Yeah, I see our gradient has dropped to negative 0 0.07. So that means need to drop the throttle drop the throttle to coasting and if the speed continues to increase I'll use the independent brake to slow down a little bit oh another tunnel okay speed is slowly climbing so I'll give it a little bit of independent brake Still on a downwards hill. I've given it a little bit of independent brake. Reducing the brake a little bit. Just enough to keep it moving, but not to stop. Okay. So I'm going to end the, end the video here. Hope this was helpful. And uh, if I was able to help you, great. Uh, be happy to help. So let me uh, put, the, put the stop on here. And that's that. Okay. So um, that, that's what I found. Now, unless you're having a different issue, uh, uh, I'll pull up the other save and see what's what if you need me to. Give me a little bit of time to upload this. Uh, up, I'm trying to, if I upload this to YouTube, it'll take too long. Um, actually, no matter where I upload it, because this is actually a 4K video. Uh, 